Hey everybody. So lately I've been getting a lot of questions on how to download a font. Um, my personal favorite website for free fonts is dafont.com. Um, they have lots of different options and they're all um, organized by type. Um, so you can find kind of what you're looking for pretty easily. Uh, some of my favorites are always under handwritten and calligraphy. Um, so let's just pick one off handwritten. Um, I really like the shorelines, but I've already downloaded it. Um, oh, here we go. Bromello. That's kind of neat. So all you have to do is if you look over here, it says download. You just click download. Now on most computers, especially the newer types, it'll bring up a little bar down here where it shows you your downloads. Um, for me, all I have to do is click on here and it opens the box. And you'll see there's all sorts of um, information on here. Uh, where to get some more details about the font, which usually contains um, who made it, how they made it, stuff like that. Um, and then there's a character map that always comes with it. Um, you can print this out or not. It's, you know, it's up to you. You can save it. I don't. Um, so in order to install, what you're going to look for is where it says open type font, true type font. So these two. And they're usually got a little A in the corner. Um, I always just open it. And that's what you're going to do. You're going to open it. And then you see you can either print it, which will print like this whole information, which is another way you can save all the information from your font. Or... Like I said, you can print that little map. They don't all come with that little fancy map, so this is sort of a nice way to have that information. Um, all you have to do is click Install, and you'll see the little box comes up where it's installing. It goes really, really quickly, and your font is on your computer. Now, you always ask, how do you get it into Design Space? It's already there, but if you've had Design Space open when you install the font, you have to close Design Space. So what I always try to do is I download some fonts before I open Design Space. And that way I don't have to exit out of a project I'm working on. It's just a lot easier. So I'm just going to make a new project so I can show you where to find your font because that's the other next question that I get a lot. Um, so let's just make a text font. Let's just make Good Morning. Oops. Typing in an awkward angle. It's a little hard. So, you can see it already, it always defaults to Cricut Sans. So what you want to do is up in your upper left hand corner under font, you can open that and it will bring up all the fonts. Now this one under all has every font that Cricut offers and many of them you have to pay for. And that's where we run into a lot of problems with people asking, well, why I made this project now it wants $4.99? It's because you used a paid for font. Um, so you always want to go to system because that means the fonts that are in your computer. So it'll have all your normal stuff um, from like Word, but then it also has what you um, have downloaded. Um, now there's two ways to find it. You can either scroll and look for what you're looking for. Um, so you know there's like Autumn Moon, um, but you can scroll all the way down. But if you remember your font name, which obviously we just don't downloaded it, so we know you just type in a couple letters and it'll come up. So there's Bromello. So right there. And there's your Bromello font. And you can, you know, do whatever you need to do with that. Um, I'll do another video on letter spacing later, but I um, just wanted to show you guys how to download fonts. If you have any questions, please don't hesitate to ask. Um, there's lots of websites to download from. I just prefer to font right now just because I like a lot of their options. Um, you can see they have, um, this one is super popular, I Love Glitter. That's the one where you get the little heart in between the words. Um, Beauty's been very, very popular. And I believe the other one is Honeymoon has been also very, very popular. Um, but yes, if you have any questions, just let me know.